Welcome back, everyone. Centerville's youth football program is working to make their players safer on the field. We helped recently purchase new helmets designed to prevent serious injuries. Tony and Rosea are here with more on the new technology. It's great to have both of you here. Uh, you know, this is something that we see in the news quite often when we're talking about sports injuries. Uh, you know, even in the you know professional world, um, the kids are something you know you definitely want to pay extra close attention to and. You guys have done that with uh, these new helmets, huh? Well, tell us about it. Yeah, well, the reality is, is football gets a, a bad rap in terms of concussions and what that looks like. And so we want to bring the latest technology to the football field. So we've updated the new Rydell Speed Flex helmets for all of our youth players, first to sixth grade. So what does it mean? What, how is this safer? Tell me, tell me well, about it. Some of the unique uh, attributes to this helmet are the inflatable uh, kind of pads on the inside. There's more of them. There's more places to put the air in. Kind of get a look inside there. And the other thing that's huge is the chin strap. If you've ever played football, you know that the coach just rips chin straps in order to uh, try to get that nice and tight. But they have these brand new locking mechanisms, which are going to secure the head in an easier, kind of uh, tighter way and keep them safe on the field. Roseanne, as a mom, um, you actually bought this same helmet for for your kids last year. This is your son. This is my son's helmet. If you look closely, you can see the dents and the dings. Yeah, that he takes hits with. He <laughs> took hits with last year. Yeah, we um, we purchased these because um, obviously safety is very important. Both our boys play football, and um, they're the newest on the market just to keep the kids safety. And it's not only that, the comfort level is is a lot better with these. Um, when kids first start in the year, it's heavy to wear a helmet, and these are um, designed to not only be safer but they're also more comfortable. So we both invested um, for both our boys to do this. And, and now we're doing it for the whole program. Yeah, comfort is key, believe it or not, as I was just saying during that commercial break. I actually did play football at one point, like fifth and sixth grade, and I remember that the helmet was, I mean, it was nothing like this. Like the chin strap, as you pointed out, comfortable, and mine I remember rubbing all the time on my chin. I remember that uh, it really didn't even line up with my chin, honestly. It was kind of like around my neck, which, you know, that that's pretty really dangerous. No, yeah. not at all. It's not uncommon to see players oftentimes try to rip off their chin strap in the middle of the game or they don't get it buckled in time for the play. But then with this new technology, there's no way you're going to mess up the chin strap like we used to. Well, my son has played football, and I've had the mom say to me, I can't believe you're letting your son play. You probably heard that too, Rosie. Oh, and and yeah. this, it's such a great investment for Centerville. It is. Safety is our you know first priority with the kids. Um, so any, any steps we can take, it was a big investment. Um, these are not cheap helmets. Uh, we're going to spend fifty-three thousand dollars on purchasing these for the organization. But um, we just want to let the public know that we're spending the money wisely, and their safety is the number one priority. And hopefully, other districts that aren't using the yeah, follow we'll suit uh, safety is paramount. Thank Congratulations, you so much. to Centerville. Thank you. We're excited. All right. Well, and later today, be sure to tune in to first step.